slow back. Excuse me, I am the real dead sick calling. The fuck? You are not dead sick, you were used. Who? How did you crack our security? My idiot dog could crack security. I told you I'm dead sick. Hold up, who says? Did some dead sick god ordain you? Do you have some kind of certificate? We have Bagley. Bagley? Everyone has Bagley. There are several five star coffee shops within a two mile radius. Look, I don't know what you think you were doing, but you were tricked by some rich asshole named Peck. They know about Peck. Maybe they know about the virus. What about the virus? Shut it, man! Hey, if you guys got yourself in deep shit, we can pull you out. Fuck it. Some of our crew are launching a virus to halt the train service at Waterloo Station. They said no one would get hurt, but... You did a good thing telling us. Maybe you can be real dead sick someday. Maybe not. Why'd you tell him that, you knobhead? Their security was flimsier than all of your excuses for putting off that diet. Yes, I read your blog. I had a look at the virus. It'll do more than halt British Rail. It'll derail a train. Whew, damn. Once we're inside the Waterloo Station system, all we need to do is hack the right train and manually engage its braking system. No problem. Leave it to me. Maybe this isn't a good time to say it, but uh, I've only seen trains in the action movies. Here's an idea. Stop pissing about and stop the runaway train.
Fuck yes! Done and dusted. Yes, yes, you're very clever, but not everyone's lining up for a high five. Albion for one. Apparently they don't like you mucking about with their trains. CCTV shows multiple hostiles incoming. Yes, I understand. evidence of the fake dead sex adorable shenanigans to the media now. I'm glad we're inspiring people, but I want it to be for actual good. Yeah, speaking of which, what do we do with the rest of those dead sex poses? Oh, please, can we keep them? I promise to feed them and change that newspaper every day. I've added them to your contacts. Thank you. This time we're turning our focus back on the media to look at my former employer, the GBB. As we know, the broadcaster has been through a lot of changes since the Hassani government gave in to pressure from his corporate backers. In a startling update to the Vanessa Ahmed sex tape story, we've just received information from a credible source within the DedSec network that the sex tape was in fact perpetrated by proxies of billionaire tabloid magnate Rudolf Peck. Evidence received by this network only moments ago outlines the broad conspiracy of extortion intended to smear the hacker collective. More alarmingly, authorities are currently investigating a narrowly averted train derailment. Details to come as they become available. <laughs>